Okay. You know what's the best weapon against a sniper? Surprisingly, running up to their face and shooting. That's in me. I am very disappointed in the guns in this game. I do like the copperhead, though. Their turrets were so useless. <laughs> His arm. Defeat the Kang Tao, optional. Uh, get the motorcycle, or get on the motorcycle, optional. Follow the Kang Tao's tracks. Um, I feel like the whole get on the motorcycle thing worked out. There's one of the vehicles. Broken. Okay, one of them drove off over there. The rest must have taken home and with them. If they manage slick moves, V. Hmm? Nice better work. hurry then. There we go, we've kind of finally chopped them to bits. Okay. Get on the motorcycle, optional. I'm getting on the motorcycle. Oh, look at Pan Am just teleport behind me. Wonder how that looks. <sighs> you mean the turret that's not working? <laughs> anything else here. Enough. There's nobody here. Left a few peeps behind at the airstrip. Rest went with home. You were right. No mad's car same. did die. They're looking. They tried to put her back on her feet. The oil pump died. I feel like this dialogue was meant for minutes, all the events that happened five minutes ago. They're coming for him. Don't worry. You know what? What? This is my life right here. I step out of one pile of shit only to trip into another bigger one. And now... What the hell? <laughs> Jesus Christ. Okay, covering you. Okay, I guess we're just stopping. What's going on? Stop, stop. <laughs> well, hi, Pan Am. It looks like we're both glitched right here. Is that a good sniper position for you? I could go in stealth, but no. Hi. <laughs> of course, why not? Pressing the heal button and it wouldn't heal. 
Ugh, whatever. I feel like we'll I need to. Anything else here. Are Enough. you kidding me? There's nobody here. Better check where King Tao took him. Left a few peeps behind it. You were right. Nomad's car did die. They tried to put her back on her feet. But the oil pump died. Pistons couldn't take it. Gave us a few I minutes, maybe, but the Caldos, they still got a head start. Damn interference. They're coming for him. Don't worry. You know what? What? This is my life right here. I step out of one pile of shit, only to trip into another bigger one. Pan Am. And pulling everyone else after me. I'm done. You hear me, P? I fuck up again. You better give me a good kick in the ass. But you didn't fuck any... Promise me. All right, I promise. All right, I figure I would just let that dialogue go, so then we didn't have to deal with more messed up dialogue. Also, that's cool. Nothing new here. Did get some new boots and pants. Ooh. Ooh. Yes, rocks don't exist. These tracks lead up past the hill to an old filling station. I would you that's where they're holding help. Is she floating again? Yeah, she is. Oh my god, but it's worse. <laughs> or better, depending on your opinion. <laughs> That's great. Where are? Hello, Pan Am. Hello, no, honey. Hello, hello. Switchy to a sniper rifle. A sharp shoots and gavar. Where is it? There it is. Wait, can I take this side off and use iron sights? There we go. I can. And what's this? Increase rate of fire by 5%. Sure. I can! Ooh! Interessant. You won't get out of this alive, you bastards! It's a weird iron sight. Oh crap, they're coming up here. I'm hiding behind my bike. So, the sight on this is broken, kind of. Are you kidding me? I died again. How is it that I could rush in so easily on the okay. other part? But not oh, thank God. Are you still broken, Pan Am? Pan Amsicle? Alright, this time we'll keep that sight on because apparently the iron sights on that thing are broken.
There we go. Oh, she shot the turrets out. Wow, he's broken. Alright. Let's try this again, even though it's probably not going to work. Oh, the turret spawn. You know, the turret that wasn't there before. <laughs> Jeez. Is the turret dead? from the turret <laughs> it does too much damage for what it's worth I just toss a ton of these. Fire! I'm not liking this. All right. We're going to put that back on. And we're going to put this on. Actually, what sights can we put on this? What's this? Uh, we'll try it. God, the turret from outside's killing me. Just heal! Holy crap! What the hell is shooting me? Dumbass AI. Jesus Christ, why do those turrets do so much damage? Oh, hello. What? <laughs> Something is still shooting. Who 
sent you? Hey, easy. We gotta talk. Who are you working for? You're Nobu Arasaka. Do you wish to take me back or... What a shit-eating rat. He's about to either scream or run. Shut him up already. Not a fan, I take it. You haven't found a fan in him either. Motherfucker doesn't know who to be scared of more. You or Arasaka. Don't take this personally. I seem to recall you were gonna tell Takamura when you got Helmet. Yeah, just a sec. I'll call him. Hello, guy. Um. Let's see this. Bizarre. Ba da da da. Bizarre. Na -na -na. Oh, I should have did the fox sneaks and blah blah blah. Uh, whatever. If you are looking for a table, just remember you have helmet and that's one hell of a card. Try to win something with it. Takamura saved my life, remember? Because it was in his fucking interest to do so. Still just biz. He's no friend of yours. Takamura, good news. Got helmet. Alive. What did he say? Alive. Alive. Not too talkative now. Taking him to the Sunset Motel. I will come to you. Keep him there until I arrive. You got it. See ya. Better take him somewhere you can talk in peace. True. Looks like your new Chumbas are here. Chumbas? Sure is. Take him outside. Toss him on the bike. Stay right there. What? The cavalry has arrived. Mitch gathered together a few elder colonies. <clears throat> the road was clear. I don't think we were spotted. We would still do better not to hang around too long. What do you plan to do with him? Just gotta ask him a few important questions. I sure hope you get some important answers. So. Everything's done here. All clear. I heard Mitch is alive thanks to you. Thanks to V and Pan Am. They both saved my ass. I just hope he was worth it. It's all I tried to raise, Scorpion. Maybe I could help out somehow? I think you've helped enough. I tried to stop him. Sure. Just turn around now. Let it all be damned. You're good at that, aren't you? Look, Sol, it really wasn't Pan Am's fault. Careful. You and me are not buddy-buddy. Besides, nobody's blamed anyone for anything yet. Sure. Right. Pan Am was just helping me. It was my doing, my fault that AB got hit. Without me, Scorpion and his people wouldn't have gone out to fight. That's the truth. When you're Ronaldo Caldo, you are always responsible for yourself and your people. The circumstances change nothing. Perhaps Pan Am should ask herself if she's still an Aldo Caldo. Damn it all. Glad to see you, Mitch, but why'd you even come? Saul, he came with our people. We took care of the bodies. I told him what happened, and he told us to up and follow you. He was worried something would happen to you, to Pan Am. Saul? Look, maybe you two don't see eye to eye at the moment, but your family and Saul will do anything for family. The thing is, am I even part of the family anymore? You know you are. Come back to us. Seems like a lot of Pan Am's problems are her own problems. Like, <laughs> she literally puts it upon herself. Sorry you had to witness that. Things just get complicated. Dramatic sometimes. But... I will manage. And you, you look out for yourself, all right? Think that's it. Till next time. They're coming. You got a minute. Let's move. Until next time. Take care of Scorpion's bike. It's yours now. Oh, I'm getting a bunch of dead people's bikes. Cool.
All right, we got like nine minutes, so let's go ahead and talk to Hellman. Hey. Where am I? What is this place? Want to talk about your little invention? Biochip you made for Arasaka. Fine. But let's get one thing straight first. Yorinobu Arisaka didn't send you? No. This means you must have an offer for me. If your boss will pay more than Kang Tao, I believe we can talk. Nobody sent me. I got a problem, and you're gonna help me. And what does that have to do with the biochip? Got Silverhand's construct in my head. It's literally driving me crazy. And I know it's only gonna get worse. That is, unless I remove it. And that? None of that's on the billboards I saw. Not even in the Silverhand. Construct. That's impossible. Where did you get this biochip? Clepped it off Yorinobu Arasaka. Job for a client. But the client left me out and to drop. And you decided the best place for it was in your own goddamn head. Actually, wasn't a bad idea. Construct rebooted me when my own goddamn head took a bullet. I always knew Yorinobu's plan would fail. I just never imagined it would turn out like this. Arasaka's prized tech really is in the very streets of the city. You have to remove the biochip from my system. It's not that simple. Look, you made the thing, didn't you? So where's the problem? If you're telling the truth, you slotted in a new experimental version of the biochip. I know you can't just yank it out. My ripper you said- You showed that to some fucking street doctor? Who else knows? I needed help. Or did you think the first thing that came to mind was downing a Kang Tao AV? How's the prototype version different? It's got a different engram, something more... Aware? Aggressive. The biochip is what's unique, not Silverhand's engram. The previous version of the chip was only used to communicate with pre-saved engram. It was rare as fuck and cost a fortune, yeah. This one's rarer. Meant to install and activate the engram in a new body. When I left Arisaka, the project was still in the trial phase. How do you put a price on immortality? Who could even afford tech like this? Nobody. This model was meant to remain in-house. The prototype was Saburo Arisaka's personal commission. He oversaw the entire project himself. So if it weren't for you, Arinobu, nobody would have found out. And if not for you, the project would not have been a success. This is a true breakthrough. Sounds like, uh... Sonorbu... Oh, fuck, I forgot his name. They literally just said it. Saranobu wanted to immortalize well, himself through a chip. Say something. Now shut the fuck up. Yeah, yeah, great. Your tech works. Now get it out of me. Well, well. I would have to see it first. Whoa, we just met. Haven't built up that sort of trust yet. How did you think this was going to go? If you want me to help you, I must examine you. Okay. Hmm. Unbelievable. It looks like... Can't believe this Seuss the one who's gonna help us. What? What is it? What a pity I won't be able to examine it fully. Yeah, real shame. You could have been his guinea pig, too. Tell me how to get rid of it. I'm afraid I have bad news. Your neural network has completely deteriorated. It can no longer function independently of the chip. The only thing I could... Woohoo, it's bargaining time is to give you information on a good clinic in Sweden. They'll help you through the terminal stages. Minimize the pain.
But you said the project was in the trial phase. You don't actually know how it'll end. Oh, I do. I just saw the construct devouring your brain. It's programmed to take over its new environment. At all costs. And your little meat brain is helpless against it. So no matter what, sooner or later the engram wins. Yes. And from what I've heard about Silverhand, that seems to be exactly his style. Huh. I see my reputation's grown into Arasaka legend. What exactly is going on in my head? You tell me. What's it like to have two personalities? Because it's not like you're hearing voices. You are both yourself and Silverhand, simultaneously. I can see him and talk to him. You're not talking, but yes, I understand what you mean. Have you noticed the Construct's influence on your decision-making? Sheesh, give it a rest. When it comes to my decisions, Johnny really is just a voice in my head. Maybe he has a different opinion, but he can't make me do anything. Agreed 100%. You are one fucking stubborn. It's not host. as if one of you wins the debate. The scale simply shifts, slowly but surely. What do you mean? You will start doing things that were once unthinkable, at least to your old self. And you know exactly who he was. A fanatic. A terrorist. A suicide bomber. Well, fuck me. Who's trying to mess with your head now? That is why I believe it would be better for you to consider clinical isolation at this stage. At least Johnny never whored himself out like you. Are you defending him? Or is that Johnny speaking? Oh, let me guess. He already tried to take over your body. You know, just for a little while. No. Would you, though? Could be fun. Johnny... Kidding. But watch out. Suit's getting ready to talk your head off. You know what? That's enough. You just playing for time? Because I can't tell. Are you trying to convince me you're useless? I mean, in that case, I can just shoot you in the head and save us both some time. Ah, oh, finally. I will try to help you. If you come with me to Kangtao. I'll try. Just isn't gonna cut it. Actually, it's almost like you're trying to buy your way in with the Chinese at my expense. Do you even realize how much data is in your head? Even if I can't help you, the data must be saved. Well, fuck me sideways. What a half-brain gonk. You just <laughs> admitted you're right. Jesus Christ. Forget Kangtao. Got any other ideas? If you think there's anyone else who can help you, I could give you the blueprints. Complete project documentation. Kang Tao offered quite the sum for it. You got it with you? He's got to. Gonk's fucking useless without him. He... Takamura? What the hell is he doing here? He's got a few questions of his own for you. You play nice. He might even save your ass. I'm almost done. The blueprints. As we find someone fluent in techno battle. What'll you do with him? I haven't decided yet. Are you serious? You know me. I can be impulsive. He's all yours. I'll give you two some oh. space. I hope we can come to an understanding. That is certainly in your best interest. V, I will remember this. Ah, this heat. My throat is positively parched. Mm. See that? Fuck me. Just look at that. Unacceptable. Inhumane. That is why you will see the truth. What the fuck is going on? Sons of bitches. Whatever you gotta say, say it. Got something eating at your code, that's cool. Been trying to learn how you're wired this whole time. To know who I'm dealing with. 
Thought you were just unlucky at first, but I kept watching and finally realized what your problem is. Always been a corpo cog, a replaceable part. Once Sokka booted you out, stripped you of perks, best you could hope for was to be a scab exterminator. I sure seem to know a lot about my past. Well, seen flashes of your past, just like you've seen flashes of mine. Honestly, I'm scared of the day I'll start seeing your memories as my own. Shit. If it's a two-way street, I'll somehow have to live with the fact that I let Deshaun best me. Fuck me over. How do you find life under my skin? Well, most things are either too big or too small. Not to mention the clusterfuck that are your hormones. And the lag between sight and touch. Infuriating. When you take a bite of pizza, it takes ages before I know you fucking burn the roof of your mouth. Plus, used to be five minutes wouldn't pass before I had a fresh cig in my hand. Now I'm itching for nicotine. Getting used to it, I guess. But it's no fucking picnic. Listen, will I... Notice the change? Or is it one of those things where I'll wonder why I ever feared it? Worst thing you can do to a human. Rip their identity out of them. That's all I know. Can you just tell me what you want? What you really want? Help me settle my score against Arasaka. That's it. Let's get out of here. Not having control. I can't stand it. Seeing some things are out of your hands. Don't be ridiculous, V. Whole world used to revolve around Silverhand. Now, no one gives a shit. Okay. I'll tell you why I want to destroy Arasaka, but I'll only tell you once. Want to hear it? All right. I saw a corpse strip farmers of water, and eventually of land. Saw them transform Night City into a machine fueled by people's crushed spirits, broken dreams, and emptied pockets. Corpse have long controlled our lives, taken lots, and now they're after our souls. Come on, don't exaggerate. V, I've declared war not because capitalism's a thorn in my side or out of nostalgia for an America gone by. This war's a people's war against a system that spiraled out of our control. It's a war against the fucking forces of entropy. Understand? Do whatever it takes to stop them, defeat them, gut them. If I gotta kill, I'll kill. If I need your body, I'll fucking take it. Johnny, take a sec. We got fucking it. Fucking hell. You still don't see it, but you will one day. Okay, interesting.